my youtube channel my name is taylor if you are new don't forget to like and subscribe i greatly appreciate it it is day four of vlogmas it is december 4th which feels kind of crazy to say it's already friday tgif and this will go up later tonight <laughs> i didn't film yesterday i just had a really overwhelming day but I like put it on myself I'm not sure some of you guys might also be like that. <laughs> I just like overwhelm myself with different things going on and there might not be any rhyme or reason behind it but it doesn't mean that my like feelings aren't valid by it by any means but I was just having one of those days so uh, I did not film and I have a fresh mindset going into today I am back to back with meetings this morning, so more than likely won't be seeing a ton of that, but this afternoon and evening, one of my best friends and my maid of honor is coming up and will be staying with us and we're going to plan out um, some of my bachelorette trip, which will be fun. I'll show you guys uh, kind of like that process and us just really brainstorming and talking through it. And then, yeah, tomorrow we are going to a local boutique to have her try on some bridesmaids dresses. I've been looking online. I don't know why I'm still holding that. But I've been looking online and I, I know what I like, but from this one designer in particular, I'm not really sure about the fabrics. The fabric of my wedding dress is just a little different and I want to make sure that in person the bridesmaid's dress kind of has a similar feel without someone having to order it and then have to ship it back and deal with all the hassle of that. So I found a boutique that's actually nationwide that has the, the designer. So I'll take you guys through that process and I'll show you guys more tomorrow. But I'm sitting in line at Starbucks. That's how we're starting off our morning. And I'm going to actually try one of my good friends, Marissa. She posted on her story her Starbucks order and Marissa, I screenshotted it. <laughs> and I'm gonna try it. I have not been having coffee in the morning this past week. I feel like I've been trying to get off of the caffeine because y'all I was drinking upwards of two to three cups of coffee a day and I was like girlfriend you gotta stop hi Jesse can I have a grande cold brew with light ice light cream and one sugar Light ice, <laughs> light cream, and one sugar? Yes. Okay, anything else for you? Yes, and then can I also have a uh, cold brew with, um, sorry, can I have a grande cold brew with okay. cinnamon almond milk foam, okay. sweet cream cold foam, so the, you want us to combine the cinnamon almond milk and the sweet cream cold foam? Because those are two separate drinks. Um, Sorry. sure. Uh, maybe just the cinnamon almond milk foam. Okay, just the cinnamon almond? Okay. Yes, and then can I also add to that three pumps of white mocha? Absolutely. And then um, just topped with nutmeg. And then nutmeg, okay. Anything else for you? Uh, I don't believe so, that'll be all. Okay, that'll be 974 at the window. Thank you. Awesome, thank you. 
Well, that was complicated. I got a complicated order. Um, but not really. I just didn't know what I was ordering. Okay, I'll show you guys more when I get back home. Oops. It doesn't look nearly as picturesque as Marissa's, but we'll see how it tastes. <laughs> Wait, we're gonna try it. I might have to mix it up because it looks like the white mocha might all be at the bottom. That's pretty good. It's very festive. It's very festive, but. That's good. I wonder like if mixing is in. It's not as sweet as I thought it might be, but yeah, that's pretty good. All right, Marissa, it's a, it's a good recommendation. If you haven't tried it, I will put the order here on the screen. Oh, look who's here. Look what she got me. Where's this book cup? I don't have one. Oh, Connor I, I can't have a pup cup. I can't get one unless he's there with me. No, and you get, you, you wouldn't put your collar on. They're not going to give you a cup of whipped cream without a dog. <laughs> I don't think so. They do. I've done it. No, you have not. I have many times. I'm sorry, buddy. I'm sorry. Trying to guilt me. He knows. He knows. He's sitting there waiting for it. I'll get you some whipped cream. Come on, let's go get some whipped cream. Come on. It's the next best thing. Okay, so I don't think I've talked about this yet, but Christopher and I are getting back on like a exercise routine. Would you call it an exercise routine? Yeah. Just like exercise routine, ha like good habits, and we wanted to make it a little fun. And I believe we got this off of TikTok, kind of, but I've only seen uh, this. No, what do you mean? That was not from TikTok. I, I know, that. I know, but we've seen in the past. I don't know. Other, yeah, you I haven't know. even heard what I'm gonna say. I know what you're We've seen in the past other people do this with savings. They'll like write certain number amounts like, on a card, they put it in an envelope, they draw a card for the day, and that's the amount of money that they save, which you did see on TikTok. You saw on TikTok. Okay, he's, we're in a mood. Anyways, so what Chris did was, so what we did was write the numbers 20 through 50 on these little note cards, and we included a few zeros in there for some rest days. But each day we pick we pick a card and these are the ones that we've done thus far. So yesterday was 48 minutes and the number on the card, I don't think I mentioned this, is representative of the amount of time that you exercise. So it doesn't matter if it is like running or weight training or yoga, Pilates, you name it. it not, not walking. Just not walking, <laughs> just not walking. So. I'm gonna shuffle these a little bit. We've been in the 40s primarily, is what we've been drawing. And today we are going to exercise for 32 minutes. How do you, um, how do you make your vegetable soup? Yeah, I just made a pot. Oh! Um, mm -hmm. I start by sauteing the, uh, and a little bit of olive oil, um, onion, mushroom, I don't know what vegetables you have. I have an but onion, I we have mushrooms. Onion, mushroom, peppers. Carrots. Green onions. onions. Yeah. So I just kind of cut those, and as I cut them, I just kind of saute them a little bit in olive oil, just to kind of, I don't know, get a little bit of flavor happening. 
Um, and then I put in the mushrooms. Like, yeah, you know, I'm listening. I wouldn't put a lot of peppers in it, but I put some. Um, I even used like arugula. I had some of that that needed to be cooked zucchini in mine this morning. Um, and we even had like some tomatoes that needed to be used, so I cut those up, and then I also Here's put a can of tomatoes. Okay. And then once you put all that in, put your broth in. I added a can of beans, and we had some barley, so I put that in ours. But you can add a little bit of rice, like a quarter cup, like not a lot of whatever starch you want to add if you want to add any. Um, and then. Um, and then I add um, to mine, I added um, um, a teaspoon of um, garlic, salt or powder, a teaspoon of onion, salt or powder, salt and pepper, it's pretty much all you need. Oh, my goodness. There's a lot of peppers. so many peppers. Yeah, so I pretty much just got rid of everything I needed okay. to get rid of. A strong elbow. Oh. Anna, just ready to eat. Ooh, steamy. <laughs> Don't let him. <laughs> oh, spin move. The onions really did some damage to me. The onions really did some damage to my eyes. Make them It's a lingering onion. Oh my gosh. What is it? You smell. Oh my oh gosh, oh oh gosh. Oh. oh we're trying to get away. Whoa! Oh, whoa. Oh. Buck and bronco. Oh you buck and bronc. Oh he's trying to swim. Oh my That's more like it. What are we doing? All right, we're going to ignore all the sugar in this thing, which actually, come on dude, focus, there we go. Which actually is not as much of the total sugars that some of the other juices have. But you guys, this stuff is so good. It's so good. It is just about five o'clock. I just wrapped up all my work, work for the day and for the week. And I'm going to get in a little bit more editing. I started editing today's vlog over lunch instead of exercising. So hopefully I can get this vlog up before 11 p.m., which is overall the hope. And yeah, I'm really excited. And today is national. National what? Today's national what? Cookie day. Oh yeah, today's national cookie day. So I think. I was right. Yeah. I just guessed it. No, you didn't. I we've been talking I about just this. Yes, at random. Christopher. <laughs> it, anyways, since today is national cookie day, Insomnia Cookies, which I think just about everywhere in the U.S. has Insomnia. It's a pretty big franchise, but they are giving out free cookies. So we're gonna go drive down to the closest one, which is by State's campus, and grab a free cookie. That has not been there before. 
you city dog. Gunner, that was my school. I know. Woo. Do you see your dad? As I am waiting for Chris in our local IGA just to grab a few, few things for dinner, I think I'm actually gonna wrap up this vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching and if you have been with us from the beginning of this vlog, you know that I mentioned uh, starting to plan out my bachelorette trip with my maid of honor uh, tonight. I haven't forgotten about that. I will film it and I'll include it in tomorrow's vlog when we go to look at bridesmaids dresses and all that fun stuff. So I'm just going to like wrap that into it and that way I can get this video up tonight. So thank you guys again so much for watching and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Oh my goodness! You gotta heat them up. They're cold. You just took a bite of half the cookie. Yeah.